zoom of footage at the beginning there. So I just need to wait a couple seconds and then it fades in and I say, Howdy there YouTube, Price here. We are playing some Tokyo Jungle over on stream. Um, so let's hop back in. I need to turn that down in my ears. Uh, so I have played a little bit since the last time we played. A uh, couple of rounds. Um, but I got our kitty cat up a little more in strength. You can see, uh, hold on. Um, I don't have any way, really. There you go. You can see our stats have gone up significantly. All right. Um, so we're getting there. We're getting there. Game is a bit loud. Okay. Okay. So we're back as the kitty. We're being orange kitty archer. Yeah, the best we can. Um, and let's just see how it goes, y'all. Kitty, kitty, kitty. And for those of y'all who haven't seen this game, this is a game in which you play as animals trying to survive the Tokyo apocalypse. It's a very arcadey type game. I'll be running around, killing critters, eating them, and trying to survive. Now, I don't think I have any challenges just yet. Defeat 10 animals, score two clean kills, and head for the suburbs. Okay, let's go ahead and mark the ground here. I want to try and sneak up on these rabbits over here. So you can kind of prowl a little bit. Ah. Sometimes you can get away if you can like really predict where they're going to go. You can uh, leap in front of the way. Oh, also, I should equip some things because we have tons. The items don't actually break when you use them as another animal. They actually just have like a durability. Um, who was that? Ninja Puppy with them 11 months saying meow. Everybody, drop some bears. Okay. Let's go with a cozy sweater. And some kitty paws. Look at that. Look at that. Look at our little critter. How cute is that? Okay, here we go. Ah, almost got that one. <laughs> Fancy kitty, indeed, indeed. So for those of y'all who don't know, maybe you're, uh, you weren't at the last Tokyo Jungle stream. Um, my goal in this game, <clears throat> uh, in this game you can develop um, like permanent stat upgrades for a type of animal. Uh, nice double kill. Um, so, <clears throat> but it has to do with like building up your character in a round and then um, like having multiple generations of your animals survive. Um, it's a roguelike version of Stray. <laughs> oh man. You can also unlock a whole ton of different uh, critters. I've just played this game for so many years, and this has been a goal that I've always wanted to try and achieve, um, is turn one of the basic critters in this into um, a, like a powerhouse, just build up their stats. So that's my goal. We may do a situation where we kind of go, why can't I eat? Why can't I eat those? Oh, those are cats. Oh, I thought they were rabbits. Oh, I'm a monster. Those were other cats. Oh, geez. Oh, geez. You, they don't allow you to eat your own kind. Um, but I am still a solo cat. Price, I'm a monster. I know. I will have a bunch of baby kitties to make up for it. Okay. We are a rookie. We want to rank up to boss. Um, because that's where we can have the best mate. And the higher quality mate that you have, the... Um, oh, <laughs> I saw him there. Um... The uh, more stats that get carried around. Catricide. I like that. Oh, man. I would love to kill a sheep. We'll kill a beagle instead, though. Beagles can mess you up. And they like to hide in the brush and then do, like, the sneak attack at you. Dang it. Ah, I wanted the, uh, the sheep. So our kitty cat is pretty dang strong. Our kitty cat can take down some pretty big critters. One round, it took me a little while. <laughs> One round, I was actually able to kill a horse. <laughs> it's a pretty big critter. They are one of the tougher late game 
critters, the horses. Because they're incredibly fast, and they actually do a lot of damage with their kicks. Playing as herbivores, honestly, is like the tougher way because it feels like plants are a lot harder. If a if there's kind of a famine situation going on, it's a lot harder to find plants than to uh, find animals to eat. All right, we're above boss. So now with our goals, uh, I need to head for the suburbs, which is the direction we're going in. We completed these ones. So every 10 years, you get these new challenges to get. And essentially this is how you earn like a lot of extra stats. Um, if you can complete all of these and even like flip and survive 75 years plus then you unlock this um, tuxedo item which is incredibly powerful but not very likely for us i would say it's more likely that we are going to get through to like level like year 30. i feel like that's kind of the more likely situation for me oh that's a golden retriever he wanted to fight and then he saw me kill a pig and he was like you know what Never mind. All right, let's make sure to go mark our territory. You have to mark all of those flags, and that's how you... Ooh, these guys are annoying. All right, I'm not even going to worry right now about eating everything necessarily. Oh, you got scared. Yeah, you better run. Kitty of Doom. All right. But you do need to eat to, like, fill up your hunger and stuff. Um, so you do need to eat a little bit. Okay. We got that one. All right. Now we're heading a long way around. Okay. Hey there. I could have taken that guy down. Let me tell you. You ready for when the kitty cat solos a crocodile? I got close. Last time, I got close. It's just that there was also, like, a tiger, and there are two crocodiles in the area. Although, I will say, it kind of helped having multiples because they were distractions. But no, Kitty, Kitty's got claws, man. Like, let's see. Do you want me to try and take out this... Oof. Kitty wants milk. <laughs> Moo indeed, y'all. Look at all these points. Just keep eating, man. Look at all that. All right, who's over here? You always gotta be careful when you're coming around a corner and there's like animals around. Y'all can't see it, there is a map behind me. Um, so I can kind of see these little green dots of where things are. Okay. Do, 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 do. When it's nighttime, they sleep a lot, so you can kind of like zoom through. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. There we go, that's a high quality mate. If they have the shinies, then that's what's called a high quality mate. Now, I'm gonna quickly pop over into this next zone because that's where our next quest is, is to go there. There we go. Now, I'm gonna head back and mate and a portion of my um, stats will become permanent for every uh, round of that I play of cats going forward. Now, I know that this was a Yorkie, so I wanted to be careful. It's actually called a Silky, but looks like a Yorkie. I'm, I'm assuming they are roughly the same uh, breed. 
Okay. Little yappy dog is what I would call it. That, that little yappy dog at my mom's house. Mate. Okay, so watch, we'll get a little stat bonus where we'll say like stat upgrade thing. So we just permanently for all cats got life plus 10, stamina plus three. So that's the things that I'm working on that I wanna get as many of the, those as I can. Very similar, only difference is the head shape. Got it, resist, thank you. Okay, so right now we don't have any challenges. Once we hit year 11, we will get the next challenges. But one of those challenges this is why I like to like look ahead of time. One of those challenges is head for Dogenzaka. So I'm going to start heading in the direction of Dogenzaka so that by the time I reach level uh, year 11, I'll already be there. And that way one quest is gone, finish the other two, we're good to go. Um, that's my strategy. I think that that's kind of the prevailing strategy. You'll also see we have a ton of little kitties following us around. Those are basically free lives. Um, the higher the quality mate that you have, the uh, more of those that you get. They don't really fight with you. Sometimes they'll throw in a move or two. Um, I think mostly if they are getting attacked, not you. Um, but mostly they're your lives. You're the one doing the business. Catch up, though. They will get teleported to you if they get too far behind. Uh, it's raining, so I actually can't see creatures on the map, but they still could be here. Do, 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 do. Later, Nivy. I mean, not later because you're lurking, but you know. Do, 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 do. All right, there are creatures up on the top there. All right, I can drink water to kind of bring my hunger back up a little bit. Later on, stuff will start to get toxic. Um, so then we have to worry about like exactly what we eat or drink or whatever. Whoa, is this blocked off? Oh no, never mind. I thought I was <laughs> I thought I was further up. I'm very confused. They teleport like Minecraft pets, exactly. Just zoom to you. Alright. We are looking for Ooh, sleepy chicky babies. Little little snacks. Little 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 chicks. Little snacks. Ha! <laughs> Ironic, I'm wearing a Brady Spears shirt and talking about toxicity. That's a great song. That's one of my go-to karaoke songs, y'all. I did it on that karaoke thing way back when, didn't I? Okay, those guys are running. Oh, man, they're going far. Okay, let's go ahead and mark. Sometimes you just got to accept that, like, things are going to maybe get away from you. And sometimes they'll run right at you. You just noticed Brittany? Yeah. No. If you've been here for a while, you know, I'm a Britney fan. Like, back when I was in uh, middle school and whatnot, junior high, as we called it here, um, you know, it was one of those things where uh, Britney was huge, but wasn't supposed to be for boys, but your boy was listening. That's just the kind of music that I like. That kind of, like, pop back in the day. I also like other music, but I like that music. All right, almost year 11. What am I playing? This is Tokyo Jungle. Um, it is a, did we update the thing? I thought I did, yes. Um, it is a sort of arcade -y game from the PS3 where you play as animals trying to survive the Tokyo apocalypse. Probably the whole world apocalypse. But the place is, it's been overrun with, um, like, nature and stuff because people are no longer here. Um, okay, if these guys run back at me, it's going to be incredible. Okay. Let's go wide. I'm going to wait just a moment because there's so many of them here that I could really get on a string. Come on. Come on. Get in my line of sight. Come on. Ah, <laughs> they all got away. <laughs> Meow. All right. I can also see what direction they're going, though, so I can also kind of, like, go behind them. Wait, where'd he go? There was totally one there. Okay. Please tell me this is a good mate. It's an okay mate. That's fine. Um, we might come back here to mate. We might mate in Dog and Zaka. 
Oh, chimp. That chimp is chasing. Oh yeah, they're helping. They're helping. Oh, there's another one somewhere. Oh, it's it's a that's a beagle. Yeah, you better run. All right, eat. Mate isn't good enough. Yeah. No, we we want we want Max. Which is why I'm gonna also mark here. We've got plenty of time. Because I think I've almost already completed all my quests. Dogenzaka is now polluted. Oh no! This is a problem for me. Because the my food is now going to start to become spoiled. Over time. So I need to avoid that. I'm also going to have trouble um, seeing things. So you can see that some of the bodies turned like purple, and that means that they're toxic, and you do not want to eat them. Non-purple will actually um, reduce your toxicity, because you're just slowly gaining toxicity as you move along. Um, oh, I didn't mark. I need to mark. Um, there is another mate all the way at the other end of that place that I started. <laughs> if you eat them, you'll be slipping under. Oh, what's up, Beagle? Get wrecked. Hey, hey, whoa. You really want this? Is that what you really want? Is that, was that a smart choice that you made? Do you think that was good? What you did there? Mark, please. It will, oh, it did, okay. It just didn't do the animation. Or did I, oh, I did it before, that's right. I did it before I hit the thing. When toxicity hits 100, you start to slowly lose HP. You can just think of it as like a poison. I do wish there was a way that you could take them down and immediately eat. Okay. Almost marked this whole area. Probably be another couple of chimps or beagles. The beagles love to hide in the uh, grass and, and jump at you. Okay. Let's run back. Let's see what this mate is over here. And then let's look at what the next challenges are. Oh, I have not had enough calories yet. I need like 400 more. That's fine, but I need to do it before we mate. That's not going to do it for me. Nope, bad mate. Okay. Do, 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 do. So now we're heading back. Oh, crap. Did not even notice that guy. Well, cool. Maybe you can give me my KCALs, man. Close. You know what? I'm just going to eat a little bit of toxic. Is that enough? Uh, do I have... Okay. That got rid of all that. Oh, and it's no... It just became, like, not poisonous. Okay. Um, hey, bud. I could use some non-crappy food. Thank you. So I used that water bottle. I wish I hadn't, because I was able to get non-toxic pretty much right after that. Would have been able to. Um... But, whatever. You get those items as you go along, and so sometimes they're, sometimes they're good. All right, what kind of mate are you? Also a terrible mate. Um, so we're going to run all the way to the other side of this place over here, where we started, and hope that there's at least a good mate. Hoping it's a great mate, because there is a good mate right here. That's a guarantee, which we may end up using just simply, like, because, you know? 
Cause I, oh, gosh darn it. Ah, oh, crap. They're so fast. I hit it just too late. Oh, he's, he's looking at me. There's no way. Wow. I think I hear an animal with fleas. You can get fleas. You just have to run through water. Is that a sleeping bird? I didn't think I, I didn't think those were in this. Now each like pool of water you can only use once, I think. So they're not like an endless supply of food protection. This better be a, at least a, Ah yeah! There we go. Prime. Now that's just prime. So let's look at what our next quest is gonna be. Defeat 20 animals, change generations once, claim the boar territory. Ooh, gonna have to figure out what that- oh no no, here we go. Change generations twice on that one, and find Jungle 24 in Dogenzaka, which is like a specific store you need to run by. Um, pumpkin chair! Yes, Janice, the pumpkin chair is back there. It's huge. Uh, that's USDA Prime right there, Benny. Um, I'll probably pull up a map to figure out exactly where that is, because it's tough to find them. Okay, going up. Let's get some more permanent stats. Already, this has been a very successful run. We've gotten two um, prime mate situations, so we're going to increase our stats a lot. Uh, d defense and stamina. I would love to inherit some damage, but, you know, I guess it is what it is. I think there are some... There's something over here. Oh, crap. <laughs> I'm going for it. This is going to be crazy, y'all. Can I hit his face? There we go. More damage. <laughs> right, y'all? Horse. He's right over here. Horse Hunter! <laughs> Two hits! I am a lot stronger! <laughs> Who needs to eat? Oh, man! Dude, that was huge. <laughs> uh, I think I tied to Dugazaka. Which is empty of food? Crap. Um, okay, I'm going to have to look it up real quick. Hold on. Do, 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 do. I know that there's actually like a map that I can find. Because I have it on my phone. I downloaded it. Um, see. There we go. Love it. Open image, a new tab. So basically, I have a map right now that shows me every um, one of these special places. So, Jungle 64 is not that far in there. So, I'm going to. Um, Actually, let me double check. Sorry that it's pulled up like that. Yeah, it looks like it's not that far in there. So we'll run in and then run back is the idea. Okay. It's going to look like this for a bit. Okay. There's got to be more horses, which is bonkers. There's so few critters around here. Oh, they're deer. Okay. I will leave them. So that when I come back, I can take them out because the, um, uh-oh, stream buffering, so be careful. <laughs> it might fall. Um, so I can eat them on the way back because I'm going to be hungry. That's the idea. Eating them right now? Why? Don't need the food? 
All right, so Jungle 64 should be right here. Oh, look at that. It's right there. Oh, Jungle 24. Wait, isn't that the right one? Oh, oh I got to wait until it's I'm level 11 or you're Oh, you're 21. Crap. I, I got a little ahead of myself. I heard something over here, I thought. But no. Well, got a little ahead of myself. Let's run all the way through then. Because I do think there were, um, there's a little bit of food in the area just past this. And if I have to, I can, um, I have to wait one more year for the challenges to pop up. If I have to, I think I have some discount food. There's birds, like, let's try to, uh, ah, crap. They saw me. Give me a little. Okay. Okay. I see that guy up there. He'll be hard to get to. All right. Piggy. Piggy is food. Come on. Come on. Life decreasing due to hunger. Yeah, so now we're okay. Just had to... Why am I not marking the spots? Because I knew that I was going to need to eat. I was, I was more importantly going for calories. Um, now I can head back. Uh, primo pet food. Nice. Um, so now I can mark along the way. Ooh. It's hard to pass up. Nice. Full on wolf. This game looks mad fun. It's so good. It, uh, for a while, you couldn't play it. Like on the PS4, there's no way to play it. Um, but they added it to the PS Plus streaming service thing that they, they've added recently. So you can stream the game if you have PS5. From which year? It was a PS3 game. So if that helps you kind of place it in time. I owned it way back in the day. So good. Oh. Okay. How are we doing in terms of our challenges? I know we did the Dogen Zaka one. Wait. Oh, I need to go back and find that. Change generations twice and mark six times. Okay. We will do the marking. Easy. Changing generations twice might be tricky. Because we're already at 22. The, pri the, the prime way to do that, which I didn't do, is to wait to change your generation, your first one, um, until this this time, or your second one, rather. You can't go 20 years with one critter. Well, you could, but it would be very tough, I think. Hope they add Legend of Dragoon. Oh my gosh. Yes. All right. Let's just quickly, because I know one of the mates is going to be right here. I just want to check the quality. Bad. Okay. So... We'll easily be able to mark six times. Oh, let's go see our jungle thing. The thing with the bad mates, they will try to get you. Like, they will try and walk up to you. <laughs> so you have to be careful. Like, you have to give them a wide space when you're trying to figure out which one they are. Okay. I know I've got deer over here. It's moving in my direction, so I'm trying to go wide. Again, y'all can't tell because y'all can't see the map. But it's one of the prime ways. Oh, it's not, not one of the deer. But it'll do. It's one of the prime ways you're going to be able to um, do that. Okay. So basically for my generation after this, I might have to settle with like just the quickest one I can get. Oh, and I can't mark this territory because that's where my parents are from. That's right. All right, we'll go through the shop district. That'll be fine. You can't use the same territory that your parents had. And it's also usually a pretty empty zone anyways, so you wouldn't want to. I think I saw something hiding in some bushes over there, but whatever. If they're in the bushes, they don't show up on the map, obviously. 
Do, do, do. Yeah, I don't know if we're going to get the two generations thing. How many other things do I need to do? Mark six times, right? That one's easy. Marking will happen. Okay. Doo -doo -doo. No bumming off mom and dad, exactly. I going to sleep? No. Y'all heard from your friends. There is a vicious cat in the neighborhood. Ah, <laughs> almost got that one. If you can just like get them once, if you just snap like uh, smack them once, then you're golden. All right, so for the next one, next set of challenges, we need to be in the boar territory. We don't know where that's gonna be. So we'll probably wanna stick somewhere central until that happens. Food is now easily perishable in the blistering heat. Yeah, so same deal. You can only eat it for a little bit and then it's gotta go. Cat Yakuza. Oh gosh, the mating thing's not happening. Is that a tomato plant? Yes, you can play as herbivores. And herbivores eat plants, obviously, that are all scattered around. Plants have different qualities. Um, you can still fight back, um, but you have to eat plants. But pretty much any animal you see, I think any animal you see, actually, you can play as in this game. You can unlock and play as. Some of them are harder than others. Go! Don't forget about my laundry. Ooh, thanks. Ah, oh, he's getting away. <laughs> oh, no, he's not. He stopped. Oh, wait, no, he's still going. He's running. He knows I'm coming. Crap! <laughs> they turned! All right, all right, all right. Y'all are all going down. All of them are going down here. Ah! <laughs> All right, Cal. Yeah! Gotcha. Okay. That cow was fast. I know, right? Booking it. Cows can get moving, you know? Yep. Yeah, I'm not even gonna try with the two generations thing at this point. I will do one generation right now. The reason I'm not fully eating them is I keep on worrying that they're going to go poisonous. Later, resist. Um, I will go check my laundry here in just a moment. The dryer usually takes a bit. Oh yeah! There we go. All right, now please give me some permanent attack. I keep getting life and defense. <laughs> Bunny's just running around. It's like, look, we're busy. Look at all them sleeping kitties. Attack plus five. Love it. When you can get permanent attack, it's a good day. All right, we're going to head over to the Shibuya suburbs. Actually, no, we're going to head up to um, Shibuya Station because it's kind of central. And then once we see where the boar territory is, because that's where we're going to have to go next, we'll check there. Remind me about the laundry again after we die. <laughs> I don't want to stop in the middle of a run, and we're probably getting close to the end. Like I said, around year 30 is when things get tricky. You're going to start seeing more like tigers and lions. Things that are a lot tougher to take out. I can't quite take out a tiger yet. Rower. The rabbits have cleared out of Yamanote Line East. Like, look, a hyena, right? It's a little bit bigger of a thing. Or 
the chicken breast. And again, remember, I can't see the critters now because of the uh, the rain. I can't see them on the map. So I have to kind of be a little cautious. Tigers, lions, and bears, oh my. Yep, they're all in this. Now, one thing that sucks, and I want to know if there's any way for them to fix this, is... <laughs> flipping zebra. There's no way to get the DLC critters anymore. There's a lot of cool ones. There's like a panda. There's like... Um, oh, he's almost dead. He's so close to dead. It's coming down this way. Ah, oh, dang it. Don't you run away. Don't you run away. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Gotcha. Nice. Okay. Yeah, not enough time to mate. Like, year 30, you can see it's coming up. It's got the C. That's what it means, like, the challenges are over. <laughs> At part, Meerkat says, Remind me about the laundry again after we die. That's a mood. It's true. Horse. All right, at this point, I'm just proving that I'm the apex predator, okay? Like, look how much damage I do to it now. Remember how much damage I was doing before? How's it feel, bro? Like I said, the way that I should have done that, because you can look ahead, right? I should have saved my generation before this until, like, the first year that the challenges happened. <clears throat> and then I would have a full 10 years to do the second one. Why did the camera suddenly shift down like that? The camera is now borked. And this sucks. All right, now it's fine. What the heck? We're running. Because he just called in reinforcements. Now, the food is rapidly deteriorating, so it's all basically gone, but take that, son! I'll give my HP back. <laughs> Apex Predator, that's how Benny... <laughs> Alright, where's the boar territory? Okay, it's a Dogenzaka. Cool. And what, what are my other challenges? Change generations once, defeat... Okay, that should be doable. Oh, man. The camera keeps, like, shifting down like that. How are we doing? We're doing all right, Rosa. Oh, my God. The camera. Why does it do that? It's only been doing that here. But y'all see, right? That one I couldn't get a perfect kill on for some reason. Oh, nice. The uh, rain has gone away. I can now see where all the critters are. There's a lot of them. Which is actually good because of how many I need to kill. The cat had the decay card. <laughs> yeah, poison teeth. Little snack. Chicks are the best when you're just trying to, like, build up your number of kills. They're a one-hit kill for, I think, everything. Oh, he says as it gets away, as both of them get away. Wow. I lied. And the chickens themselves are fast. Okay, there's a mate over here. And it is an okay mate. He doesn't even think I'm gonna come for him. He was confident. Yeah, 
Yeah, let the boars be distracted, man. Okay, I don't actually need to be eating. Oh, they could charge. Did y'all see that? He went fast. But they're not that buff. So I can take him out actually pretty quickly. Give me a little bit of food. Are we Forest Clan, River Clan, or Shadow Clan? Oh gosh, I have no idea. Chrissy reads those books or read those books. That's the the warriors, right? At the beginning of Stray, she got so excited because she was like, oh my gosh. It's like playing at the very beginning where you see like all the cats. She was like, oh my gosh, it's my own Warriors clan. She was so happy. We are Star Clan. We are the clan of cotton candy. Oh, is he a boss? He broke my My costume broke, that's what it was. Defeated 20. Easy done. Now I just need to take back their territory and find myself a prime mate. You had no idea. It was right there. Woo! That one charged right through. <laughs> all right, all right. He was trying to charge. Eat it. This cat is ruler of the boar nation. All right, let's go uh, get this. Mine. Okay. It's made over here, and it's right next to something. Probably another boar. Yep. Just an okay mate. Oh, man. It's got me cornered. Ow, ow. Help me out here, buds. Okay. Got an okay mate. We know there's another okay mate down south. Um, where we uh, came from. <clears throat> so that was all three challenges, right? Oh, except for changing generation, which is what we're working on right now. Doo doo doo. Come on, show me some sparkles. Nope. All right. So the only one we haven't seen is the one all the way out uh, to the right. So we're going to check. And if not, we'll come back. We'll grab this guy. We'll have plenty of time to make it back here, I think. Oh, crap! You stay away from the tiger. You definitely stay away from the tiger. And the gator! Okay, you know what? Change of plans. Change of plans. You're good enough. <laughs> <sighs> Give me another nest. I want to lock in as many of these stats as possible. And uh, tiger time is the time to lock in your stats. Oh, we did lose a couple kitties. There's one dead, two dead kitties. Oh, that's sad. Okay. This has been a good run, huh? Yeah, permanent attack. Awesome. All right. I do not expect to survive that much longer. Well, I would love to get down to the shop district, but we'll head up north now. Well, actually, next challenge. Wait, did I not change generations right there? 
It's, it might be about to give me the thing. Yeah, Yamanote is the place to go anyways. There we go. I was about to be like, what? Okay. Oh, God. You know what? Let's YOLO it. Oh, no. Run! <laughs> Tigers may be one of the strongest creatures in this game. It was very not smart of me to uh, challenge him. Pivot. 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 All right. Get interested in something else. Like these guys. Yeah, do your special. Oh, God, he just killed my other kitties. I'm a solo cat now. Yeah, fight the, fight the wolves. Yeah, he's fighting the wolves. Oh, but he's still not happy with me. Come on, baby kitty. Be safe. Come on, kitty. You can make it. Oh, one of our children. Okay. Drink water. Get the heck out of here. <laughs> one of my children. All right. We're still not in a good spot considering everything once it is like super dangerous. Okay, that works. Woo! I survived. But our whole family did not. It was foolish of me. And we paid the price. But not this one. Like, we paid, like, a different price. Like, the price that people pay. The... Um... You know. <laughs> eh. Ah, oh, come on! You were dead already. He just didn't know it. Biggest, baddest kitty. This might be one of my best runs of all time, by the way. I just want to go ahead and put that out there. That is another tiger. It looks smaller, but don't let it fool you. It is another tiger. Ah, I was trying to get real close. All right, well, you're going to go get eaten by a tiger. Ooh, Panther is scary. Panther is, I think, stronger than the tiger. Or, well, it's different, but I like the panther more than the tiger. The panther's, like, faster. Oh, hello. Well, you know what? Maybe it's time. Oh, crap. Nope, it's not time. It's not time. Um, I was supposed to get a bite on him. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> now we know. <laughs> Our limitations are tiger and gator right now. All right, that's the wall. That's the wall we got to get over. Laundry reminder, thank you. Because this just, just came fresh out of the laundry. Nice clean hat. Okay. I mean, not bad. 35 kitty cat years, y'all. Close. And let's just quickly look at our stats. Okay, yeah, um, look at that, look at that, pretty big boosts, we're getting up there, now, I'll say this, I don't know how the upper limit fits with these other creatures, you know, like, are these stats just, I guess they are, like, that's maximum stats right there, so, like, these are ones you can't get, by the way, these red ones, because they're DLC, which, Kind of sucks, right? So I can fight them, but I can't unlock them. So I would love it if, if PlayStation found a way so that all these streaming games were the most complete 
versions. I think they should do that. If you can't buy the DLC because it no longer exists on the store, then why shouldn't you be able to play with it, you know? If I can't buy it, then you should give it to me for free. Um, do, do, do. Okay. Well, y'all over on YouTube, that's going to be a run of uh, some Tokyo Jungle. Um, we'll probably play a little bit more, but uh, thanks for watching. So um, we'll see you later. Okay. Um, bye.